realise I wasn't sitting down right, so that's that's the intro. <laughs> Hello there everyone, welcome back to the channel, my name is Elliot Webber and uh, I had a video plan this week, um, apologies for the lack of uploads, uh, I've been fairly ill for the past week and a bit, uh, so that's why there was no Senna Proctor video, I was going to make a reaction but uh, a lot has happened um, behind the scenes privately with my life. Um, so I've just sort of wanted to focus on that a little bit more and I haven't really focused on YouTube. But as with the most recent announcement, I thought this would be best to add the Senna Proctor part into it. And that is we have two big returns for the BTCC at Setterton uh, next, next weekend in two weeks time. Um, Senna Proctor already, as we know, will be returning to the BTCC for the remainder of the season, who is replacing Dan Kamish, who is replacing Michael Kreese. <laughs> as, as, <clears throat> excuse me, yeah. Senna Proctor is returning to BTC right returning to BTC racing, even though he's never raced for that team. Okay, nice one, Elliot. Um, what I meant to say was Senna Proctor is returning to the BTCC and the other big return is Jessica Hawkins will be coming back to the BTCC as well at Setterton with, with motor-based performance uh, alongside Sam Osborne. She will be replacing Andy Neat. Fans, arise. I can hear you cheering already. Just calm down, okay? Let's talk about this in full. So, of course, the, annou the uh, two announcements that we've had over the past week have been, of course, Senna Proctor returning to BTC Racing. Uh, but no, let's do, let's do ladies first. Let's start off with Jess Hawkins, the most recent announcement. Yes, Jessica Hawkins, W Series racer. Um, she will be returning to the BTCC for what we believe is a one-off at Setterton um, in two weeks' time. She will be alongside Sam Osborne, Jake Hill and Ollie Jackson for Motorbase and MB Motorsport. She is replacing Andy Neat. As I said, fans, just I'll let you cheer if you want. Okay, there, you've had your three seconds of, of shine, All right? You can, you can simmer down now. Um, so, yeah, Jess Hawkins is returning to the BTCC. Uh, as I've said about 40,000 times already in this video. But yeah, so um, my reaction, a little bit shocked. Um, we know that Andy Nee is, is very much loaded. Um, so it was expected that he'd be doing the full season. I highly doubt this is down to money. Um, you know, Andy Nee, he is a very, very, very rich man. So I'm sure, you know, I highly doubt it's down to money. My guess, personally, is that it was down to the incident at um, at at Thruxton. Of course, as we know, Andy Neat was involved in a crash at Thruxton, which caused Glyn Getty to, to land uh, upside down and turned his 88 still into an 88. And, of course, Jade Edwards, was the, the other female racer, was also involved. Um, so, I would imagine... Maybe there's been an argument with Motorbase and Andy Neat, and now they've let Andy Neat go again. For all we know is that Jess Hawkins will be in that car for the for the next weekend. Um, she won't be doing the full season, as sadly the W Series um, does um, clash with uh, some of the touring car dates. Of course, as we know, the W Series this year will be on the Formula One package. Um, so that is why Jess um, won't be doing the full seat, won't be doing the rest of the season of BTCC. But great to see her back in the car. Um, I really hope she can she can learn a bit uh, after her her last outing uh, with Power Max Racing in the Vauxhall was also at Setterton last year. So Jess Hawkins already has some experience. She will sadly be carrying some weight because of uh, of the late entry. She will be carrying some weight. Um, and yeah, let's just see how she gets on. Uh, Sam Osborne had a fairly decent uh, run at Thruxton, as did Ollie Jackson. And Jake Hill, as we know, was the driver of the day at Thruxton, the current championship leader. So Jess has some great teammates she can work with. She'll probably, I'd imagine she'll be the exact same where she was uh, last time. And yeah, that's Jess Hawkins. Now let's move on to Senna Proctor. So yeah, uh, second and last. Um, oh no. Yeah, last but not least, let's say, Senna Proctor. Um, of course, Senna, as we know, did miss out on a seat this year, um, whether it was due to funding or just for the fact that everyone else found a seat. Senna sadly lost out. 
Senna is one of the most underappreciated drivers in the BTCC. Let's not forget, he is a race winner. He has taken multiple podiums throughout his career in touring cars. Has raced for Power Max, has raced for BMR, has raced for Accelerate. And now he is moving into the Honda with BTC Racing alongside uh, Josh Cook. And of course, the, the uh, Jess's fellow female race driver, Jade Edwards. Um, Senna, um, of course we know he's got a bit of money as well due to his dad Mark, who of course also raced in BTCC in a Honda Civic, uh, ironically enough, about 15 years ago now. Christ, I feel old. <laughs> um, but yeah, Senna, another great uh, man to come back to, to touring cars. Again, thoroughly, thoroughly underrated. Senna is a phenomenal racing driver. He was a front runner in Janetta Juniors, almost won Janetta Juniors, remember, five, six years ago. So Senna definitely has potential. Um, he will be, I'd say, I think he'll be mid-pack, I'd imagine. And then I think eventually might start getting on the podium a bit more, might start winning races. Um, maybe in with a shout of the independence title. I was about to say Jack Sears and I remembered he is a race winner. Um, and yeah, let's see how Senna and uh, Jess go on. Of course, once again, another short and sweet video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And please, please, please keep it. Keep it PG, okay? I know some of you don't like Andy Neat. But please, just, just keep it civil, all right? There's no need for any bad mouthing of drivers. Um, so yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think uh, below. If you are new around here, be sure to subscribe and please subscribe because I do have some very good videos planned in the future. Uh, so yeah, if you guys like this video, be sure to give it a like and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.